Okay, how's everybody doing out there? First of all, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal H Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Partner with our business partners in Dubai under Black Camel. I'm really enjoying that contract. This is an amazing contract, and I love doing business in Dubai. I really do. I really do. So uh, let's talk about the technology we have here. Now, this right here is... Um, a uh, blackout cloth we designed. It's pre-coated, which means you don't have to paint it. It is eight-way stretchable. You can stretch it over any frame you want and build your own frame. I'm going to actually be building a frame pretty soon and doing some demonstrations. Now, also to keep in mind, if you're seeing any lines or imperfections in the screen, that's due to the fact that the material we had to test it on, I wanted to make sure that it married well. It's actually, we have another piece of, uh, of surface coming in. It's much more advanced than this, but it's actually made from the same surface um, we want to make sure that the chemical is going to marry well and we weren't going to have any problems uh, with the transition of transferring the, the, the formula onto the surface. Now, uh, so far it looks fantastic. It's reacting well. So we made the next stage and basically contact the company we do business with and ordering a huge roll of this stuff to have come in and, and press it down and just start working on it. Now the size will be the height of this, the tallest the screen will, black o'clock will be, will be six feet. Um, as in length, we can go as far as 12, we can go as far as 20 feet if we choose, if we choose. Um, as for uh, the different sizes, uh, you'll be able to get 100 inch to 120 inch uh, at 16, 9, 16, 10. You'll also be able to do uh, 235.1 because we can do about 12 feet, maybe 14, 15 feet in length. All right, so uh, how will the screen be shipped? It will be shipped on a roll. It has to be shipped on a roll, and I'll tell you why, because the surface that we're using now was actually folded up downstairs. It came to me actually folded up, and once it was coated uh, and stretched over the frame, there were problems with seeing the pre-existing um, lines already embedded in the screen, and that's something we don't want. So it has to be very important that whatever company we're doing business with, we already have one already, that it's being shipped on a roll. It has to be shipped out on a roll. So we're gonna have shipping tubes. We're gonna have a core system installed in the middle. That way if somebody sets something on top of the screen, the casing doesn't crack or, or bend. And then on top of that, they will be marked fragile, big time. All right, so um, just to show you the distance, we're gonna step back, we are 10 feet back. We're using a ViewSonic 1080p projector, uh, no form of 4K upscaling, uh, no 4K projector of that. And we're using this um, at 3200 lumens. Keep in mind, I don't, you can use 4K, it's up to you. You can do 4K scans up to you, but we don't do it in our demonstrations because like I said, at this particular point, you gotta start wondering who's doing all the work, the projector or the screen. So that's why I like using uh, everyday projectors that people can relate to. All right, so. Uh, let's talk about the technology's ability to outperform other screens or the value of the technology. And this is why I do demonstrations on other high performance screens. I think it's very important that if you're going to be testing your technology, do in demonstrations against other high performance screens. And then you can show that this is the difference between my screen, a 4,000 or 5,000 or 3,000 or whatever. All right, so first things first, we have the Seymour AV 1.3. I like this particular screen because it has amazing colors. It does. It's a very beautiful screen. It's a challenging screen too to take on. Uh, second, we have the uh, DMP Supernova. Four to $5,000. Good technology, very, very good technology. And then over here, we have a um, Seymour, uh, I think this is an MS, Seymour MS right there. Another piece of excellent technology right there. Now, uh, also to keep in mind that the, um, that the sheet you're seeing on the far end is luminous. That's a luminous panel screen. So we have to make sure that the blackout cloth is going to react the same way as a panel. It has to blend in. Has to be the same way. Now, the reason why, because we want a blackout cloth, because uh, getting the surface that we press this stuff on is plexiglass, very flexible plexiglass. It can become expensive once you pass over 100 inches. It becomes very expensive, very, very expensive. And if it's very expensive, that means we have to charge more for the screen and we're trying to keep the prices at a certain price. So by doing this on a blackout cloth, it makes it easier for us to do a 120 inch screen with no problem. Hopefully in the future we do 150 inches and 200 inch screens will be fantastic. All right, so um, let's uh, remove this first. All right, and let's start our demonstration. All right.
And of course, we're going to do this in a fully lit environment. I like to do things in a fully lit environment because I like to show off that you don't have to be subjected to the dark just because you own a projector. You can be the shooter. These things look just like TVs. Now, if you notice on the far end, we have a panel there. The panel has blended right into the screen. That is the first sign that the technology is marrying well with the surface. And as you see, all the other screens are blending in also. Now we're going to come over here. We're going to do our angle gain. As you see, the DMP Supernova, narrow viewing comb, gets a little dark right there for them. Okay. We're going to hit our lights. For those who want to see the screen with the lights out. Like I said, it's like a TV blackout cloth. Consider that. It's a TV looking blackout cloth. Now we don't have a price yet or we don't have, uh, it will be launching on the 18th. Hopefully the 18th, we'll have it on the 18th or the 19th, but it will be launching. All right. Okay, fantastic, we're gonna light this out here for a bit. Cause I have some people who want to do the screen with the lights on, with the lights off. Just take the time, watch the demonstrations thoroughly through and you'll notice that I'll turn the lights out in certain, certain occasions and I'll keep them on. Satisfy both customers at the same time. All right, let's throw the lights back on. There you go. I'm gonna grab my phone, which should be over here with me. Sorry, I my phone to adjust better. Now see, when we do the demonstration against the DMP Supernova, it shows the worth of the technology. Now keep in mind, you got a screen here, a blackout cloth that you can stretch over a frame and it performs just as good as a DMP Supernova. It blends in, look, it blends in with the DMP Supernova but has better angle gain than the DMP Supernova. Well, that's a beautiful sunset right there. I sit there all day and look at that. Now, just in case if my time runs out here, because sometimes it does, my time will overlap my time. I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal H Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Also, too, for our Dubai customers, please check out our um, the contract distributor which we're doing business with over in Dubai, Black Camel. Uh, we also have two other contracts under That's Brilliant and also to Black Box Entertainment, which we'll, you'll see more of them also too. They're getting set up as we speak on doing demonstrations for the technology. All right, let's hit our lights again. And remember, my switches are right here on the side of the wall, so I gotta reach around to grab them. Why don't you look how beautiful the color is. Uncalibrated. No 4K needed. Like I said, you don't have to spend the money. People want 4K because they want that brilliant, sharp, I understand you do, but with this technology, you don't have to go overboard in order to achieve a beautiful picture. Just look at the color in that. And I have to do this one. I like this demonstration so much. This particular video demonstration, I love it. Keep in mind, this is with all the lights on. On our blackout cloth. Like I said, this is gonna be very easy to do. Take it out the tube, stretch it out, and you're done.
Okay, I gotta go. I'm Kenneth from Crystal Age Technology Screens using Smart Technology Game. Blackout Cross will be available very soon. I'd like to thank you all for your time.